Welcome back everybody, my name is Eltamar and we are going to be continuing our let's play of Pillars of Eternity 2, where we left off last time. We had just arrived at the Drowned Barrows, and a mountain commands the northern horizon. Its cliff face the likeness of a rotted skull. Scavenger birds circle high above its peak in a morbid halo. Let's go north. As you approach the base of the mountain, the beating of drums reverberates from the skull's gaping mouth and vacant eye sockets. Let's climb up to the eyes. Pitted rocks offer enough hand and footholds to climb as high as the bridge of the nose. The reverberations of the drums shakes free an occasional pebble. Let's climb to the left eye. You make your way to the ledge of the orbital socket. A sharp drop leads down into the cavity of the skull. Lights twinkle in the shadows below and voices echo up from an unseen source. It would take the right tools or an agile fall to make your way down. Rope and grappling. Actually, you know what? Let's just jump down into the eye. We have good people. Nope, we don't. We have terrible landings for two people, but that's okay. Your landing is a hard one. The snap of bone and an indrawn breath from Maya echoes in the darkness. Actually, she was the only one. As you pause to survey your surroundings, the oppressive beating of the drums throbs in your ears. We can just rest, I guess, to heal that up. I don't know why I bothered to save the rope and grappling hook. We could just buy more of those. It's not like they're rare. One of my nightmares. All right, well, we're here. What do you need? <clears throat> Simple, don't see why not. Injury's gone. Watch this. I already told those Aeotin clods were at capacity for scribes and acolytes. Those incessant drums have beaten our guards senseless. A robed acolyte curls his lip and advances on you with a look of frank appraisal. We aren't accepting new recruits. Now go! Our progress wallows as you degrade the left eye with your presence. He makes a shooing gesture. That's some questions. And it's my vested responsibility to satisfy these questions. No. Only Nemnox chosen are allowed here. And we're all full up. I should kill you for even glimpsing this sanctum uninvited. He thumbs his chin and weighs the matter. Does Ingati's chosen get the freedom of the skull, little man? Tikehu smiles broadly down at Kinook. We could use someone to reach the high sconces, but no, it's out of the question. Nimnok is god of this place, right? God of the mountain, and god of the tribe. Kinook narrows his eyes. We have the honor to serve as his scribes, researchers, and translators. The Aeton just make sure our work is swift and efficient. Why does Nimnok need scribes? That should be obvious. Nimnok loves nothing above arcane scrolls and wizard grimoires. But the Mighty One cannot be bothered to pour over every document. So we labor to make the work easier. He is, uh, shall we say, immune to literacy. Kinna clears his throat into his fist. I'm looking for Kali. The new boy. Nemnok fawns over him in the lower sanctum. Kinna grimaces towards the exit. Only acolytes, ogres, and naga go down there, and any of them would chew you to pieces. His smirk grows wider still, flashing a hint of teeth. Your dim-witted bodyguards wouldn't stand a chance against me. Savage. I'm just passing on how it goes around here. He backs away a step, sweat speckling his brow. Of course, it's not my call to make. And you won't get to Nemnok unless you deal with the Death Warden first. Death Warden? You know, Aetons. The big ones, yeah? He sighs heavily and gestures towards the hallway. One of our resident Aetons carries a wardstone which opens the way to Nemnok's realm past the gates of death. I'll keep an eye out for this Death Warden then. The Death Warden patrols the sinus of our fair skull. That's our central level if you aren't keen on anatomy. I punch him in the gut. He crumples under the force of the blow, the wind pushing out his lungs in a forceful woof. When he looks up at you, his eyes are wide and red-rimmed. Want me to hold him? I can hold him for you, so you don't have to keep picking him up. That is what you get for... <laughs> well... I am certain it was justified somehow. Take a shrugs. Do the rest of us get a turn? I don't normally condone beating people up who can't defend themselves. But in this case, I'll make an exception. What? What was that for? You've just been really insufferable since I got here. And irritation brings out the beast in you, does it? Does. I shall be the bigger man. Put this behind me. Kinnock eases himself up and rolls his shoulder. I give it five minutes before the Aetons squash you into mush. But thankfully, it's no concern of mine. Kinnock taps his chin and shrugs as he walks off. Is it stealing if I kill... Oh, it's not stealing there. 
I will take that. Anybody else have a name? No, you're just all acolytes. That's Canuck, who I punched. And if I go left, what happens to the left? There's a staircase down that isn't actually a staircase down, it would appear. Oh no, it is. It just didn't appear quick enough. So that's down into the drowned barrows. There's an Aotin Dweller. No, I'm stuck. You guys aren't against me, right? Okay. Okay, let's boo people around a little bit because this is silly. Shoot that guy. How did Shoti get over there? Everyone move in. No, Jyoti, don't die. Oh, she died. There's a lot of, like, annoying enemies here. Okay, well, once I'm able to move again, I will go kill them all. We're all stoned, though. How long does this last for? It is officially done. Somebody move out of the way. Really? This is such a stupid little hallway. Hit here, don't die. You and you fired the warlock. Kill the accolade next. Oh, on the bright side, our other people are getting some serious work in. I guess we can be the healer. Once we're able to move. Kill one of them so we can actually get past. Mobilized. When we can finally do something, we still can't do something. What is it? I'll take that knockback, though. What did we get? We got a sako and just a bunch of random magical equipment. What is it? As you wish. Excellent. What have we here? What have we there? A dagger and some random junk. And some more things. Let's not fight in closed off hallways. That was really irritating. Mm -hmm. Happy. Uh -huh. Oh, there's Scrivener Warlock. And some guards, but you can actually get into the fight this time. Not that ability. Alright, I hotkeyed it. How did I get way over there? Oh, 
Guards have a lot of armor and defenses, so we'll kill them last. Everything. Whoa. We missed like every soul annihilation. It's gonna be a running joke soon. I wonder how Takeu's unlock of his archivist is going actually. Four. It's going four well. Speak next time a challenge. We should probably find a place for him to just shoot things over and over again. Ready to brawl. Oh, another Aeton. We got disoriented and distracted and all sorts of things, but that's okay. Not a particularly hard fight, one ant on its own, no big deal. I'll take care of it. I will take that, thank you. Anybody in here? Oh, it's a trap. Trap disarmed. A chest. Soul. Some free loot. I wonder what's down here. Something. Must be the other eye, I guess. What's down there, I wonder? There is a pool of... I'm gonna assume it's water. I saw a, uh, there we go. Thing there earlier. Lovely. Thank you, puppy. Why can't I touch this thing? I guess we are not allowed to. It's just not like not letting me do anything with it. So, I guess way down. Drowned Barrows. Weird. I wonder why that pool wouldn't let me do anything. Maybe that's a way up from the ground floor. That's a possibility. I hear drums. Drums in the deep. Looks like oh. Hello, Barrows Guards, and several warlocks and other various annoyances. Okay, step one. Acolyte one. Come on, main character. Wow, Shoti just got annihilated. Like, straight up killed killed. What ability was that? She, her body just like evaporated and she became a specter, so that was... Maybe that was the Warlock, maybe we should take that on first instead of the Acolytes. Build a 
I will go kill the uh, acolytes first, I guess. Oh great, there's an ancient coming too. Let's take this warlock out. One dead. Not dead yet, but close. Two dead. Oh, now I'm paralyzed. It's grim. Killed this one. What the hell happened to me? This thing is enjoying the job. I'm hoping I come out of my weird. Barrier soon. Oh, I'm with, oh, I'm withdrawn. Shoti helped me in a bad way, I guess. Yay, one of the barrel guards is dead. Shoot the acolytes now. They're more annoying than the guards are. to come up here and flank with me. The acolytes are almost dead. I'm not sure why the Aiton Dweller is not doing... Oh, he's paralyzed, that's why. Makes sense. Finish this guy off. Almost. How much life does that Aeotin Dweller have? In total, I mean. Whatever that ability they killed... Oh, she's got three injuries, that's why she became a Spectre. She really needs to be healed. We'll rest with her. I'm actually gonna move her way out of combat range. We'll do a quick rest. Damn, I didn't know she had three injuries already. What did she get hit by so much? You were saying. We'll go up into this little alcove and just have a quick rest. All those injuries are gone. What was that? Bust item? There it is. Oh, it's a blister bomb. Apparently they're making bombs, or they have stored bombs here. I'm not sure which one's worse. That they're just storing random bombs, or that they're making random bombs. Yet another random pool. Barrow's guard. Only one, two... Oh, there's more. Oh, there's another warlock. And more acolytes. And more guards. Time to run. We can kill this one Ed and we'll be fine. Not dead though. Now dead. Character might die. I am stuck. Aid me, not even close. 
Oh, we got our buff on. Let's go. I've got this, Captain. Let's kill the warlocks. And yeah, just both the warlocks, really. And then we'll kill the acolytes. The guards can wait. They're okay. They're not that bad. Oh, that was a good hit finally with our very problematic. What the hell? Where did my character go? Oh, we got with the drawn again. Where's Ishii? Come help me, Ishii. I'm listening. There's still one more acolyte, but I don't think it's actually doing anything. It's just kind of sitting back. Two acolytes left. Never you mind that miss. I'll land the next one. I hope nobody saw that. Kind of stuck over here. This will not do. Come on. Kind of stuck over here. You won't hold me for long. Oh, immobilization. You are super irritating. Wait, what? How much did I hit him for? I think the damages were just really close together, so it looks like I hit him for like 3,870, 3,872, but I don't think that's the case. That seems a little excessive. And that's the end of that. Any injuries? No injuries. Yes, I'll take care of it. This leads to a door, but the other way leads to stairs. I'm gonna go the stairway first. Not sure where that goes. Yes, Captain. No need to ask twice. You ask too much. <laughs> no, I don't want to open the doors. I want to move back. <sighs> I wanted to move back so I didn't have to deal with the sigil of death. Doors in this game are kind of irritating from time to time. Not always. It's not a very common thing that they're annoying, but in this particular case, it was. Bakera, it is no problem. Because I can't click here for some reason because the door is there, right? So you can't technically stand there. I wonder if I use... is there a move command? I will wear this scar with pride. No, I don't want you to wear any scars with pride. I don't want major injuries from a stupid pillar that I can shoot at from a distance if I could just get line of sight to it. Alright, let's try this one more time. You need something. I am the Alpha Predator. <laughs> We're hitting it for zero damage, aren't we? even die from these things. I guess not. What do you need? Hmm, but it's not working. Let's find a different way to do this. I wonder if they are sensitive to 
to sight. I wonder if we can sneak in. What did you think? Ishii. Ishii. Quiet time. Let's go. What if we here? What did you find, Ishii? <sighs> And that's why you don't send people into death killer things. Because those wounds will instantly kill them after they get four. Let's wander down this way and see if we can find a different, safer way around the gates of death. Oh right, we need that ward stone. Ah, that's right. I'll see it done. We gotta find ourselves a ward stone first. What are we fighting? Flame Nagas and a Forge Master? I got this guy. You guys just get that one. Your Forge Master is dead. And so is that guy. What did we get from the dead flame naga? A fire naga sword. I guess. What is I'll take care of it. What an odd oh there's more. I was gonna say what an odd little area, but it wasn't done yet. That actually makes a lot more sense. Dead. Jyoti died. So I got things to kill first. My whole group is there with just two of them, so they should be fine. I missed. No. Are you guys seriously having trouble with two sentinels? Oh, Ishii went down. Sad. Not see it. It's currently unconscious on the ground. We will take all the things and whatever is going on with this anvil. It has a superb great sword, apparently. Getting lots of naga eyes. Leave it to me. Well, we killed the forge naga. Who were some sort of fire naga. But they're not gonna work here anymore. The season It and Dweller. Harvest is here. We are in behind the Aiton. Which is now officially dead. I'll take care of it. Yes. There's another one. There's another three. Right between the eyes. I hope nobody saw that. Hey, there's the Death Warden. We've been looking for him. Oh. 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 Oh.
I hit him for a couple hundred, so he's almost dead too. He's got a lot of life though. Dead. Aside from the death gates, nothing in here is really all that challenging. Alright, well... I guess we got the ward stone we needed. A lot of random ale just sitting on a table. Well, of course. What did you find she? A very trapped room. What if we here? What did you find is she? Question is why? It's clearly a hidden door there. But what ah! opens it? I'll wait for the fire to go up before pressing that button. I don't suppose there's anything here. Alright then. I'm not sure where this leads. I'm guessing it's sort of a way out, but we'll check really quickly and then we'll call it a video because we are at 32 minutes and it is time. I have to desperately try and make it to the gym today and it's not going to be a good day for it. My energy is just flagging hard today, but Leave it to me. gotta go. made a commitment to myself to do more gym, even though gyms suck. Nemnox Cloak, eh? Life of Suffering. Damage taken. We get Spirit Shield at 75%, Iron Skin at 50%, and 25% barring death door. That's actually kind of awesome. Okay, well, we're going to end the video here. Like always, if you have any suggestions or comments, please leave them below. Otherwise, I'll see you guys next time. Take care. Have yourselves a good evening.